Hey guys. Hello. Hi. It's been a while. What's up? Can I call you guys tubers? I need to find a cool nickname for our relationship, you know, like a term of endearment that I can bestow upon you, anyone that's decided to subscribe to this, anyone that's hit the subscribe button, anyone that's rang the bell, anyone that's done anything along those lines. We need a term. We need, um, not a boundary. I'm sorry for talking like that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hi guys. Tubers. I'm calling you tubers until someone gives me something better. <laughs> or until next week or until whatever. I want to talk about something. I want to talk about a lot of things. But in this very moment, I'm going to make a really short video about something that I purchased that while it performs its function, I don't like it and I think that s you could do better. You could learn from my mistake. Also, what is this lip look? Hi. Hi. Love it. It's cute, right? It's the most high maintenance lip I have ever worn in my life. But it's so cute. It's so cute. But it's not practical. Help me make it practical. If you do lips like this, help me make this practical. Because this bleeds everywhere. Everywhere. I wore it out. Like, in public. And the only thing I took with me was the gloss. So I was like, oh, everything's locked, locked. Everything's locked and loaded underneath. I will just take the gloss and I'll touch the gloss up. Well, the gloss penetrated everything underneath and made it start to bleed. And then the gloss smeared. <laughs> so then I had this watery, pigmented, gloss situation everywhere. I looked like a hot mess. I was the DD. I was the designated driver and I looked like a drunk wild child. It was not good. It was not one of my proudest moments. But like when you first put it on, oh it's so cute. Oh it's so cute. You got the, the bold top lip and you bleed it just a little bit on the bottom and then you gloss all of it and it's gorgeous. That's not really what we're here to talk about. This wouldn't be... I, this wouldn't be something I made if we didn't get off track ever. Hi, welcome to a different view of my bedroom. It's always a new. It's always a new. We never settle. We're never in the same place. We're never on time. I made a purchase. I made a purchase and I've been living with it since, ooh, when did I get this? About at the end of October. So, you know, the workout girls, workout girlies, and some guys, I guess, I don't know. I don't know how the male workout community feels about anything because I don't hang out with them. I don't watch too much of them. I watch some. I don't watch too much though. The female workout community though, loves what's it called that hydro jug hydro flask whatever the big the big jug the big jug for your water like drink it all day take it to the gym slurp it down maybe we oh god i can't imagine that much protein powder um make your protein for a week keep it with you just keep shaking it dude but I was like, you know, it would sound really awesome to only have to fill a water bottle up like twice in the whole day. Not, you know, and just like it'd be convenient and it'd be cold and it'd be like all of those good things. And in the way that only current internet marketing can work, I started getting ads for Juggy USA. And the reviews were mostly positive. 
Actually, I don't think I've seen a single negative review of them yet. I didn't deep dive too much. Why would you? It's a water bottle. Why would you deep dive into like tremendous amounts of water? It's a water bottle. You want the water bottle? Buy the water bottle. The thing that I liked about this one is it came with a little bit more personality. At least my version of a personality. They have cute sleeves. Uh, it comes with a, a clip for your keys or whatever. And a couple of pockets in the sleeve that you can put like your phone or your card or etc 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 and it comes with a handle so I'm gonna show you guys mine I'm gonna take the straw out first because we'll go over why it's not that I don't like this product it's not that I haven't been using it it is that I have some criticisms though and they might be deal breakers for you if you're looking for a giant water bottle this is a juggy. Super cute, right? Adorable. You see why I got it, right? You see why I got it? It's got all this like witchy shit all. And look, it comes with little, uh, they're kind of like crock pins, I guess. And now that I've put them in there, I can't get them back out. But it came with four. And there's holes all over this fucker that you can put these things in. But uh, it came with like a little palm and a bat and a moon and a skull. This guy also came, this guy also came in uh, darker colors. I think he came in just like black, but I'm a fiend for purple. So I picked purple. The sleeve is super easy to pop it in and out of like I'm pretty sure this guy is dishwasher safe. I don't know. This is convenient. This is convenient. And in theory, this should be convenient. Before I put him back in here, I'm going to show you guys. I did not contact customer support because I didn't realize what was happening until it was way too late. I'll also throw that out there. Did not talk to Juggy. Did not do a full inspection, like the bottle came in, it's wonderful. It's got this strap. This strap is really convenient, in theory, unless yours comes like mine. Again, I didn't contact customer support. I don't think that this is normal for them. And I do think that I can fix it if I want to try hard enough. I would take this guy and I would load him up with water and I would sling him on my shoulder. And like he can even crossbody. Like, isn't he cute? Like, look at this strap. This is a huge strap. I can crossbody a water bottle. Ta da! And I was noticing that as I was wandering around, as I was carrying this guy with me, throwing him in the car, taking him to work whenever I was still working. I don't want to talk about it. Um, something that would inevitably happen, that. Let's do it again. Do it again, do it again. Oh, okay, there we go. I can't wait to slow my that. I instinctively decided that these guys were weak as shit. That's what I decided. I decided that these were weak as shit and that they couldn't bear the weight of a full bottle. That's not what the problem was. That's why I didn't call. That's why I didn't reach out because I assumed that it was cheap, cheap snaps and that it was just going to be a part of the product and I just wouldn't use the strap. Fuck me, I guess. No. The real issue is this D-ring. You see him? He's broken. He is broken. He should not have made it through um, quality check. Accident. I don't think Juggy would fix it now that it's been so long because I really just ignored the problem. So 
So, when he's full of water and you're toting him around, I don't think you can see the stress point. I don't think he's gonna do it right now. He only, I hope that got on the mic. He only does it when it's the most inconvenient. Oh, he's working on it. He's working on it. I don't think you could see it, but he's working on it. He's gonna go any minute. Like you're walking around and he's on your shoulder or across and boom, now he's on the floor. Tragic. Tragedy struck. I can replace that D-ring. I should probably just get metal D-rings and put on there. Lord knows I could probably find some D-rings on some clothes that I don't like and could just do it that way. My second complaint is he comes with a straw. I love a straw. I love a straw. You see this makeup? You think that I want to put my mouth on this opening and pour shit into my face? No. No. I want a straw. I want a straw that would be easy for when my lipstick transfers on this because it's going to for me to just wipe it off. So the straw was actually a major selling point for me. A huge selling point. Straw goes in. Can you see this? The straw does not. Wait a second. Wait a second. Did I just figure something out? I don't, I don't think I did. Like this looks like it wants to come off. Honey how? Honey who? Honey! Like all of my, all of my criticisms of this might be biased based off of this one thing that I can't figure out and it did not come with instructions and I'm gonna have to Google this. I am literally losing my shit right now. My complaint, and then I'm gonna pause this and then I'm gonna look it up. My complaint is that this straw this opening is too big for this straw. And you see, you throw the straw in, you take one drink, you let the straw go, where's straw go? Straw gone. Straw gone. And then you're doing like the least sanitary thing in the entire world. Imagine you're out. You're out and about. Imagine that you're using this for the function of actually going to the gym. Straw gone. Where's straw go? Nasty fingers. Have to dig. You either have to dig in here and try and get this thing out or to take the whole lid off. The whole lid. All of it, honey. Take the whole straw out, get water everywhere, and now it's all over my legs, and then put it back in on the top. Because this happens. Because this is my life. I just want to do this and just look, see, see. I don't want that going on the side of the bottle. Like, it's much harder to clean off the side of the bottle than it is this like super convenient straw. I'm gonna pause this. There's actually lipstick in from where I didn't like clean my straw off first. There's gotta be something. There's gotta be something that I'm too stupid and I'm, I'm missing. And unpause. One quick YouTube search. One quick Google search. I never thought that I would have to search on something that seemed as intuitive as using a straw. Let me show you what I learned. Remove straw. There is a soft bendy bit. Like the straw, not really pliable, standard. 
please don't be on the camera on the lens but this bendy bit this guy he is supposed to be when you put the lid on the jug he flops down and when you open it back up he pops up wonderful right the way that this works is I don't think I don't think it's gonna pop I don't think you're gonna be able to see it maybe there's a small line in him that acts as a guard to keep the straw in theory at the perfect height which is this height my straw had wormed its way down to here where he was shorter so that way if he moved this direction would sink below the thing so god i i keep doing this and i'm gonna like break this for realsies and then it's not gonna be it's gonna be all on me pulled the base off put him back where that lip is so that way he should in theory be good to go and then when i put him in look look at how far up he sits my god and then you screw the lid on and when you screw the lid off look who's here it's the thing i've been living with this product for almost six months and have been begrudgingly using it i had been using it because it cost a decent amount of money it's a pretty big water bottle there uh there was a whole month where it sat empty in the back of my car because i hated it and there was another month where it sat on the floor of my office because again i hated it i hated it it was so like who wants to dig in their drink for their straw i don't think anyone does and it was all because I thought I knew how to use a straw. I guess the moral of the story, Juggy, is that you're never too old to learn something new. You should never be too comfortable to learn something new. You know, now that it's been about 30 minutes since I discovered this, <laughs> since I did my research, and checked my bias. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Buy it. Get one. If you need a big old water bottle and you want some personality. Also, it doesn't sweat. The bottle sweats, but the sleeve keeps it from sweating. It's its own coaster. We love to see it. If this is something you need, I wholeheartedly suggest it. I will now use it every day. I will not think twice about it. I will fix the D-ring. I will wear it crossbody. It will go into my car. It will go everywhere. I love it. Sincerely love it. I just gotta fix that D-ring. That makes him so hard to carry. Like, I just want... Ooh, don't. Don't. If you're gonna sling him around, close him back up because you know. Already! I wonder if I could just live with him like this. Like, that's not terrible. It's not awesome, but it's not terrible. Oh, this... It's my water jug. Who are you wearing? Whatever. Whatever. It's a good water bottle now. I'm satisfied with it. If you want to spend... I don't even... How much did this guy cost? Probably this much. Whatever. Give him a shot. Try him out. Or don't. You know, you could just use a glass of water. That's fine. I am too lazy.
to get up and uh, refill my water that much. He holds, I think, 64 ounces of water. And I drink about two of him a day. Which is now about to be a lot easier since I figured out the straw. It was a grueling process. He would go outside with me. Can you imagine being in the garden and having to dig the straw out of this? It's rough. I was in the basement working out yesterday. Got frustrated with this thing because of the straw. And since I didn't have makeup on, just was with the straw still in there, was just going to town, dumping this thing into my face. It's also not really a pleasant, I just want a straw. I'm a straw person. I get not everybody's a straw person. I know that they make anti-aging straws, which I am not beyond trying. But I am a straw person, okay? In my day-to-day -day life, I want a straw. Uh-huh. Uh. See, like, now it's ratchet. It's, we've been doing this for 17 minutes, now it's ratchet. We got a different water bottle that I haven't tried out yet. Look at this guy. Oh, ain't he cute? Oh, ain't he cute? Why this guy? Because he's convenient to take in your day-to-day -day life. Because he do this. Not quite, not quite. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. He takes a little bit of figuring out. I plan on going on a trip in July. And he's going in the carry-on and then is going with me everywhere. And when he's empty, I'm just gonna fold him down. It makes it way easier to get through securities, bag checks at venues. That's what I want. I want to be able to go from having the, the bottle of water with me and then if I have to drain it, I don't have to worry about losing the bottle. I can just collapse it, throw it in my bag, be done. Just be done. It'll be fine. It'll be great. It'll be fantastic. Okay, I love you. Okay, bye.